Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Bonsoir, 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 bonsoir. Comment nous y est? Moi souhaitez nous tout ok. Happy Monday, everyone. Today is Monday, December the 9th, 2019. Okay. So for tonight, we're going to be doing the simple past versus the past perfect. All right. So pour asseoir, nous pour le faire passé simple et nous pour le faire participer. All right. So if you guys can please share the live, invite a friend, invite a family. I'm going to give you guys 60 seconds and I will be right back. All right, we are back. So, je dis à nous pral faire passer simple et nous pral faire participer passer, okay? So, before we start our lesson for tonight, and also we're going to be doing some vocabulary words later on tonight. So, before we start our lesson, we're going to figure out what is simple past, okay? Léo du consacre passer simple. Qui ça, ça veut dire? What does it mean, simple past, all right? Simple past is when you use, simple past is used for actions that started and finished in the past, okay? Now, si wap li fwaz sa yo, nou ka remake ke ge kek mo, se an e de ke yo fini. Reason why pa osu ke nan pa li de baga ki fet nan passe. Li dou konsa ke passe sep, itilize nou aksyon ki komanse e ki fini nan yon passe, okay? Now, you use simple past, all right, regarding an action that started in the past and finishes in the past, okay? Example, she got out of bed when the alarm rang, okay? She got out of bed when the alarm rang. Qui ça, ça veut dire? Ça veut dire que Léo dit she, she c'est pour yon fi. Ça veut dire que fian levé nan kabon nan, L'el tande a l'amni sonne. Ok, ou bien l'el tande belli sonne. Now, let's do the past perfect and we're going to try to do a little bit of comparison, ok? Past perfect is used to show that an action took place before another action in the past. Ok? Yo du consan ke participase nou utilize l pou nou montre ke yon aksyon pran plas li anvan yon lot aksyon no passé, okay? Let me explain it to you guys better. If you get up in the morning, right? Si vous levez dans matin, all right? Premier ça vous fait lor lever dans matin, right? Gen moun se bouche yo bosse, all right? Now, li dou konsa ke nou utilize participe passé, okay? Pou nou montre gen yon aksyon ki fèt anvan yon lòt aksyon, okay? Lor fin bosse bouche yo, ki sa so fè? Ou lave figo, okay? Now, c'est non sans ça oui, yo dou konsa ke ou ka utilize participe passé. OK? Nou konnen ke tou les deux boy yo n'a parlé des bagages qui fait nan passé. All right? Ça li même nan, li dou konsa ke yo utilize l pou action ki commence nan passé et ki fini pa nan passé, OK? Plus tan nou utilize simple past, nou ba yon tan. OK? Now for example, si nou konn ke gen yon bagay ki pral fè ki pral fè later on tonight. OK? This would be the simple past. If something is going to happen tomorrow, that's the simple past. Say like next week or next month, OK? Something that is simple, something that we know that started in the past and finished in the past. This one on the other hand, OK? Na pale de yon bagay, oui, li rive nan pase ya. Men nan ki pwen li rive nan pase ya. Est-ce que se o komansman ou bien est-ce que se nan finisman? Se nan sans sa ou itilize participe pase. Ou itilize l nan yon aksyon ki fet avan. Ok? Na for example, um, say like you driving to work. Si ou son moun ou pral nan travay ou, ok? Anvon al nan travay ou. Est-ce que te pase nan 
Dunkin Donuts en parlant de travail. OK? That would be the first driving at the drive through to Dunkin Donuts, OK? Et non sans ça où tu as utilisé participant c'est ça. All right? Now um over here, when they agree, she got out of bed when the alarm rang, okay? Now, on this side, I wrote she had gotten out of bed when the alarm rang, okay? Now, pour même captain dem, ka pense tous les fois yo vle di même bagay, but in actuality, yo pa vle di même bagay, gen yon grand différence. This one is telling you that fian levé nan kabon lè li tande alam nan sonne. OK? She got out of bed when the alarm rang. OK? Lè alam nan sonne se lè sa li levé nan kabon. OK? This one I hear is telling you she had gotten out of bed, OK? When the alarm rang. Ki vle di ke li te deja levé nan kabon deja lè alam nan sonne. To be clear, let's say um, the moon na kabon, okay? Rose is on this side, Amanda is on that side, okay? Now, Rose got out of bed when the alarm rang. Keep le di ke, alam na sonne, Rose got up. On this side, Amanda, okay, had had gotten out of bed when the alarm rang. Keep le di ke. Amanda te déjà levé déjà les alarmes non sonné. Qui veut dire que ordonnant tous les deux bords ou tant de gain pas qui utilisé but this one right here li dit comme ça que action te fait en vent. Qui action te fait dans bord ça? Yo dit comme ça moun nan te déjà levé dans cabane en bon alarme nan te sonné. That's the first action. Qui veut dire que whatever that you're doing, okay? Whatever that you have done in the past, okay? In order for you to use the past perfect, you need to make sure you use it with the first action that took place. That's exactly what they're telling you on that side. On this side right here, yo du consacre, it's something that happened. Okay? Et puis il finit, il va continuer. All right? Et ça fait, bon, ça y aurait le simple pass. Yon bagay qui simple. Nous connaît que, for example, um, if you're driving down the street, okay? Si wap kon dina la rien ou fon accident. Okay, now you talking about that two days from now or three days from now. What just the moon consacre ou for accident? Epi that's it. Okay, but right here, let's just say like with a conduit, um, you were driving down the street. Okay, while you were driving, you were texting. Okay, now, come on, take a utilize na past perfect lan. What di consacre avant accident arrive, se texte ou tap texte. Say no terms that who use past perfect. Okay, there is a big difference. This one is telling you the action took place and finished in the past. That one is telling you yes, we know the action took place, but there are many actions that took place. Which one is first? You're gonna write down the one that happened first on that side. That's how you use the past perfect. Okay, guys. Now. I wrote some sentences on the board for you guys, and we're going to go over them together, okay? If you look right here, number one, okay? I blank. Let me make a short statement, okay? Mem soupaka weta bloa. I want you to listen. Remember, moi pa besoin nou pou nou visual only. Moi ta remen pou nou tande, especialement moun ki toujou di yo pa ka tande yo, which I know ou ka tande yo, kompren ou pa ka kompren. I want you to listen. Mwen pa prale vit. Ma pli bagay la very slowly. Okay? Try to pick up what I'm trying to tell you. Okay? Number one. I blank to him already. Okay? Now, mwen ekri twa mwen nan bod lan. Okay? Kwa mwen fe tout verb yon sa ma ve nou, nou pral dim ki es la de yo ki fe plus sens. Okay? Number one. I spoken to him already. Number two, I speak to him already. Or number three, I spoke to him already. This is what I want you guys to do. 
You guys are going to write down the correct answer. Qui ça nous pense, qui réponse nous pense, qui pi bon. Ok? Moi pral re li l'onko. I want you guys to listen carefully before you write down your answer. Number one, I spoken to him already. Number two, I speak to him already. Number three, I spoke to him already. What is the correct answer? If you think the correct answer is speak, write down speak. If you think it's spoken, write down spoken. If you think it's spoke, write down spoke. Moi pral wè ke lem a fè verb yo who's paying attention and who's not paying attention. Jean Asilis, excellent. Someone wrote down the answer, so I'm going to wait for the rest of you guys. Number one, I speak to him already. I spoken to him already. Or I spoke to him already. Very good. Those of you that wrote down, I spoke to him, that's the correct answer. Pablo, can one spoken? Okay? Because if you listen to the phrase, okay, when I di I have, okay, when di I, I kept it simple, okay. I spoke to him already. Now let's just say we pas comprend qui qui ça qui bon réponse là entre speak et spoke. Moi pour le montrer en pile dans nous, les n'a point examen même si c'est examen l'état, okay. The answer to the question is always in the question, okay. Ma di en créole, quel que soit examen ou apprend. Réponse examen, c'est dans examen en lié. Ok? Now, on dit n'a pas éliminé spoken. Nous connaissons spoken, c'est pas réponse là. Because moi pas dit I have, moi pas dit I've never. Ok? Now, nous gué speak avec spoke. Ok? Ou déjà ou elle pas speak. Parce que if you listen to the phrase, moi do already. Mo already on vle di déjà. Yon baga ki déjà, se yon baga ki passe déjà. So therefore, you know the correct answer is spoke, not speak. Okay? Number two. She has blank me for a long time. She has knew me for a long time. Or she has know me for a long time. Or she has known me for a long time i'm gonna repeat myself number one she has knew me for a long time number two she has known me for a long time or three she has known me for a long time if you think the answer is no right no if you think the answer is new Right new. If you think it's known, right known. She has knew me for a long time. Two, she has known me for a long time. Or three, she has known me for a long time. Okay. Mon qui écrit she has no me. Nous déjà connais que li pas fait sens. Listen to it carefully. Ou pas dit she has no me for a long time, okay? And I'm going to explain to you why, okay? Now, she has knew me for a long time. No, ou pas ka di new. Again, the word new it's in the past, okay? New vle di mwen te konon. Mwen di she has. Troisième personne singulier. Qui sa mon has lan vle di li vle di gen. So therefore, ou deja koné li pa new. Okay? Next. Ou pa ka di she has no me. Okay? Again, we using has people. Has. Okay? Nou nap use has. Okay, has is the third person, has is the third person singular. Okay, et même j'en tout. Qui sont à dire? What di I have? You have. Okay, ou pas qu'à dire, ou pas qu'à mettre non dans ça. It doesn't make sense. Say known. She has known me. Okay, et pas she has know me. 
She has known me. So those of you that wrote K-N-O-W-N, -N, very good, okay? Now, guys, this is what I want you guys to do. On va nous répondre question, yo, guys. I want you guys to listen carefully. Listen, guys, okay? We went over the verb. I know you guys can do it. Yo, pas difficile. I'm going to do it with you guys. Thank you for the heart and everything. Thank you guys so much. Yes. Number three. My brother hide my car keys. My brother hid my car keys. Or my brother hidden my car keys. What is the correct answer? Number one. My brother hide my car keys. My brother hid my car keys. My brother hidden my car keys. My brother hide my car keys. My brother hid my car keys. Or my brother hidden my car keys. My brother hide my car keys my brother hid my car keys or my brother hidden my car keys so write down which one you think is the correct answer okay hidden yo i'm begging you guys in the name of jesus okay listen to it carefully my brother hide my car keys my brother hid my car keys or my brother hidden my car keys he didn't have nothing to do with that he didn't baggy plus la do to do to do to guys okay listen guys Okay, before we continue, bomba no ti pull to piti, okay? Cuz mka mka we get kek na no ki get confused with the whole perfect thing, okay? Now. Mwen pral example, right? I see you. Mwen na prezan, mwen wè ou? I saw you. Okay? Mwen te wè ou? I'm seeing you. Ok, qui vle di map gade ou, ok, continue ou bien progressive, however you wanna, you wanna put it, ok. I've seen you, ok, now, mwen ba nou nan tout sans sa ki diferan, ok, now, I eat, ok, simple present, mwen pon ki ye, I eat, I ate, Okay, now this is the past. Okay, sim te manje ye. Ma du kon sa, I ate yesterday. Okay, I'm eating. Le verb la fini pa ing. Sa vle di ke yo du kon sa ke action apren plas metna, me li continue. E sa mo continue sa vle di wi. Okay, ki vle di kon sa ke right now. If I'm looking at Robinson, if I'm looking at Robinson, I'm staring at him. Pour qui ça y a foué à un gino stère là? Parce que j'aime style sous Robinson, so therefore I'm gonna say I'm staring at Robinson. That's what continuous mean, guys. Okay? Now, Lord dit qu'on sent que I was staring. Okay? Lord dit was. Was c'est un bagage qui très, il passe en encore. That's the past. Okay? This is what I want you guys to do, and also. Let me cry phrase yo sou tableau a en van nou kouri repon yo OK ki sa m te di nou mwen di nou kon sa ke depi nan use verb ki gen past participle nan tande verb la di had an apre li chanje had eaten had spoken had working had tout bagay ki fini pa en or li ka fini pa ed parce que gen kek nan yo ki vraiment pa chanje OK now Sinap use li na term present perfect guys, okay? Lab have, li pap had. Had se passe. Have se metnan, right now, okay? I have tel bagay. I have eaten. I have worked. I have walked. I have talked, okay? Nou wè li gen have la den. So therefore, deja koni verb la na perfect. Look at, look at number three right here, okay? 
ou pas qu'à dire hidden because moi do my brother ok moi do my brother hide my car keys or hide my car keys or hide in my car keys ok I don't care même si pas qu'on parle langue non ok I'm looking at the board bah ouais mais il met des has ou bien had aucun côté so therefore I know for a fact he didn't have nothing to do with that ok cross out the hidden ok when you guys are answering questions, ok? Pour nous même qui toujours après examen, les n'a pas répondu aux questions. Premier source si posé fait, cross out the one that you are sure it's not the correct answer, ok? So qu'on ne sait pas répondre là maintenant, c'est lui même pour éliminer en vain. Et moi les explique au pour qui ça, ok? Now, si au bon trois réponses, alright? If they give you three answers, ok? Premier ça va faire ou application OK là où li question den ou descend dans réponse là ou pral comparer chaque grain réponse ensemble avec question yo OK moi dis nous déjà réponse yo question c'est un dans question lié là comparer yo sous déjà ouais um, une réponse yo dit dépassé ou ouais phrase la parler dépassé OK mais ça so pral laisser effet OK ou ka gen deux réponses ou ka gen un past perfect ou ka gayon en um, simple past this is what you gonna do ou déjà connaît en um, simple present non c'est pas réponse so why keep it get rid of it you cross it out then what you need to figure out log in deux réponses qui rete ou pral reli phrase là encore pour aller qui est ce qui vraiment matché ensemble avec e question and i guarantee you Give you no response, okay? What make in a phrase like a fair langu lu? Depi wap li on baga ou senti langu lu la dan sable di li pa bon ou mal di. Don't continue. When it's the correct answer, okay? Response la flow bien doucement en bouche, okay? Now, let's look at number three again. My brother hide my car keys. No. Okay. The correct answer is my brother hid my car keys. Okay? Qui vle di ke fwe mwen serre kle machine mwen. But pou ka kone repons lan se hid. You have to know what is the past. Okay? Hide se present. Hid is the past. So the correct answer is hid. E pa hidden. Hidden have not, has nothing to do with it. Alright? So now let's do number four. Have you ever seen a shadow? That's number one. Number two, have you ever saw a shadow? Or number three, have you ever seen a shadow? Have you ever seen a shadow? Have you ever saw a shadow, number two? Or number three, have you ever seen a shadow? Have you ever seen a shadow? Have you ever saw a shadow? Or have you ever seen a shadow? What is the correct answer? Have you ever seen a shadow? Have you ever saw a shadow? Have you ever seen a shadow? So, write down which one you think is the correct answer, guys. Menorah, Johnny, very good. Amos, good job. Clovins, very good. Jean, Ruler, Rachel, very good. It's Have You Ever Seen a Shadow? Again. Mais quoi t'es yo essaye pour yo confuse you, ok? Now, yo essaye pour un havlan, yo mette le devant phrase la, why? Because they are forming a question, ok? En pile nan mou yo et kon sa yo fait. Laisse yon question yon pose yo, ok? Sa yo fait, they'll take the, um, instead of saying, I have seen a shadow, ok? Yap do, have you ever, ok? Have you ever seen a shadow? Yes, I've, contraction. Au lieu pour dire I have, c'est même bagala. Fait contraction. Dis yes, I've seen a shadow. Ok? Ou déjà ouais, ou pas qu'à dire have you ever saw a shadow. Ok? Again, you have no more. Quand on parle ensemble avec soi, 
That's not the correct answer. C, have you ever seen C a pas bon? All right. Next. Number five. He taking his dog for a walk this morning. Number one. He taking his dog for a walk this morning. Or two. He take his dog for a walk this morning. Or three. He took his dog for a walk this morning. He taking his dog for a walk this morning. Two. He take. His dog for a walk this morning. Three, he took his dog for a walk this morning. So, what is the correct answer? What is the correct answer? He taking his dog for a walk this morning. He take his dog for a walk this morning. Or he took his dog for a walk this morning. So, those of you that wrote down took, very good, okay? Again, souli phrase la, eh, bah, Let's pretend like we know like the answer wasn't took, okay? Ou pa ka di kon sa, he taken, okay? You can't say that, he taken his dog for a walk. Ou pa ka di sa, ou deja wel pa fe sen, sens, okay? He take his dog for a walk this morning. They talking about something that happened this morning. So you already know they talking about something that happened in the past. Ou pa ka di take, ou di took. Okay? Take lan, c'est présent. Took lan, c'est passé. That's how you know the correct answer is took. Okay? He took his dog for a walk this morning. Et le ou après c'est li france la. Ou après c'est took qui ki bien prononcé nan bouchou. Okay? He taking his dog for a walk this morning. No. He take his dog for a walk this morning. Or he took his dog for a walk this morning. When the answer is correct, Okadi vit jongle. He took his dog for a walk this morning. He took the dog for a walk this morning. Number six. I don't know why they choosing that one. I don't know why they chose that one. Or I don't know why they chose that one. I don't know why they choosing that one. I don't know why they chose that one. Or I don't know why they choose that one. I don't know why they choosing that one. I don't know why they chose that one. Or I don't know why they choose that one. Okay? Choose Chose, chosen, vledi, choisi. Okay? Kounia, wap mette ki sa ki fe plus sens ensemble avec phrase la. Ki verb ki fe plus sens. Are they talking about the past? Are they talking about the present? Are they talking about the perfect? Okay? Number one. I don't know why they choosing that one. I don't know why they chose that one. Or I don't know why they choose that one. We're doing number six right now. I don't know why they chosen that one. I don't know why they chose that one. Or I don't know why they choose that one. Okay. Moun ki mette. Mbadi choosing no? I said, I don't know why they chosen, chosen, S-E-N. I don't know why they chosen that one. I don't know why they chose that one. I don't know why they choose that one. I don't know why they chosen that one. I don't know why they chose that one. Or I don't know why they choose that one. Raymond, very good. I don't know why they chose that one. Okay? Now, 
ou pas qu'à dire choosing. Choosing pas qu'il place li la dit to guys. Ok? Now, we're left with two answers. Either chose, ok? Ou bien choose. Ok? Choose ou bien chose. Chose non se passe, and I'm going to show you why the correct answer is chose. Ok? Now, let's just say like wap choison rad pou mette. Ok? On va choisir rad la, ou di se rad sa wap choisir. Ça veut dire que ou te déjà fait décision déjà, oui? Ok? Inside your mind, you already told yourself, you know what, I'm going to pick that one. Ok? Moi même kap par ensemble avo, I'm going to say to you, I don't know why you chose that one. Ok? Ça veut dire que pour me dire comme ça, I don't know why you chose that one. Ça veut dire que ou te déjà fait décision sur ça. Ok? Li pa choose, c'est chose. I don't know why you chose that one. Ça veut dire que m pa kon pou ki so choisi ça. Ok? Mon ça, li même. Ça veut dire que ou te déjà décidé sou li déjà. So therefore, réponse pa choose. Réponse c'est chose. Si ou pas de foure that one nan moua, then the correct answer would have been choose. Sent your foot that one, that one n'a vint fait tout n'est pas oui. Yo déjà du coup ça mon a déjà fait décision sur rad là. So that is why the correct answer is chose, not choose. Okay guys, let's do um seven. Number seven, she has throw away her old clothes. She has threw away her old clothes. She has thrown away her old clothes. She has throw away her old clothes. She has threw away her old clothes. Or she has thrown away her old clothes. She has throw away her old clothes. Or she has threw away her old clothes. Or she has thrown away her old clothes. So what is the correct answer? She has throw away, she has threw away, or she has thrown away. Very good. The correct answer is she has thrown away her old clothes. Very good. Number eight. I have never flew on a plane. Two. I have never flown on a plane. Three. I have never fly on a plane. I have never flew on a plane. I have never flown on a plane. Or I have never fly on a plane. I have never flew on a plane. I have never flown on a plane. I have never fly on a plane. I have never flew on a plane. I have never flown on a plane. I have never fly on a plane. So what is the correct answer? If you wanted to make a contraction, ou te ka di kon sa ke I've never. Lo di I've never, se men bagay avec I have never. Okay? She's never. She has never. Very good. Those of you guys that wrote flown, excellent. Munkiakri Fayo, seriously? She has never fly on a plane? Would, again, me me la la I have. not fly. It's flown. Okay? I've never flown on a plane. Not fly, not flew. Okay? Next, number nine. We begun selling computers last year. Number two, we begin selling computers last year. Okay. Three, we begin selling computers last year. Okay. Now, moi vle nou tande bien. Okay. B e g i n is spell begin. Okay. Gen begin, gen begin, gen begun. Trois mots différents. Ok? Begin, begin, begun. Ok? B-E-G-I-N is begin. B-E-G-A-N is begin. B-E-G-I-N 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 is begin. B-E-G-I-N
G U N is begun. We begun selling computers last year. We begin selling computers last year. Or we begin selling computers last year. We begun selling computers last year. We began selling computers last year. Or we begin selling computers last year. So, Munkie Kri began, B E G A N. Excellent. How do you know they're talking about the past? Easy, last year. Okay? Last year, l'anglais let dernier passé. You know they're talking about the past. So, therefore, ou pa ka mette begin. Okay? That's the present. Ni pa bon. Ou pa ka di begun. Okay? The correct answer is begin. B E G A N. Okay? All right. Last but not least, they will have swum all the way. They will have swim all the way. They will have swim all the way. They will have swum all the way. They will have swim all the way. Or they will have swim all the way. They will have swum swim or swim one is s w i m that swim sw im i m sw m m sw um u m they will have swim they will have swum or they will have swim what is the correct answer? My question again, sir. I hope you guys do. You guys are doing a very good job. I'm very proud of you guys. They will have swim. They will have swim. Or they will have swum. I'm going to make it easier for you guys. Swim is not the answer. Okay, S W I M, it's not the answer. Okay, now, nous rete en deux. Swim, okay, or swum. Okay, swim or swum. They will have swim all the way. They will have swum all the way. So, pour mon qui S W U M, no, yo, that's the answer. They will have swum. If I they will have swim. They will have swum. Okay. Very good. Now, this is what we're gonna be doing, okay? That's how you guys are gonna be familiarized with the verbs and everything, okay? Now, I'm gonna give you guys some vocabulary. Okay. I want you guys to open your ears. Listen. Okay. Do your best. Okay, try. C'est qu'on soit à commencer adapter ensemble avec les mots, ok? Moi, je connais que j'ai quelqu'un nous qui a des difficultés pour nous attendre, yo. But ma peuple plaît pour nous ni en créole. Moi, pas peuple. Ok, I'll try to do my best. Ma peuple plaît ni en anglais ni en créole, ok? But please do your best, all right? And I'm gonna give you guys the definitions. Number one, persuade. Er, su. Aid, persuade, persuade. P E R S U A D E. P E R S U A D E. Because we have have um majesty. Did you listen to the phrase? They will have. Okay? Swum all the way. Upakadi swim all the way. Say swum. Alright? Persuade. P-E-R-S-U-A-D-E. P -E -R -S -U -A -D -E. Tanku Patrick. E R S U. A D E P 
Persuade. Persuade is cause someone to do something through reasoning or an argument. Okay? Now. Bomba nou lan bon kreyol. Ou pa kon wè lè de moun a fè diskisyon, gen yon lot moun ki toujou ap di kon sa ke, hmm, si moun mèm da fè tel ba, oui, hmm, 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 moun nan etan kou ke, koman di sa? Gon mo a isi yon kan di, um, how do you say it? Moun nan met gazolin nan di fe. Okay, sometimes, sometimes like um, before you making a decision, right? Someone is in the background, like um, trying to guide you. Okay, but jamu na pese gidola, li pa pese gidola nan slap du kon sa mesa pou fe non. But the person is like making a background. Okay, mu na fe bas. E sa mu persuade lan vle di wi. All right? Persuade is cause someone to do something through reasoning or argument. Okay? Lor koz yon moun pou l pon desizyon, ok, ou byon fè moun nan rezone a koz de yon aguman. That's what persuade means. Ok, the person that koz dat, ok, moun ki koz bagay la. Number two, reasoning. Re-z-e-ning. Reasoning. Re-z-un-ning. Ing, reasoning. Reasoning is R-E-A-S-O-N-I-N-G. Reasoning. R-E-A-S-O-N-I-N-G. R, tan kou wobe, e a S-O-N-E-N-J. Tan kou jislen. Reasoning is the capacity of consciously making sense of things. Ok? Reasoning sa vle di ou rezone. Ok? Lò son moun ki rezone, sa vle di ke ou gen kapasite pou konsyan de yon bagay. Ok, ou ka fe la rezon. That's what the word reasoning mean. Ok? You are capable or you have the capacity of consciously making sense of things. Gede moun lo esplike moun nan bagay la, li kompren, li rezone. But some people, yo pa rezone. Ou te met esplike moun nan bagay la plouzye fason li stil pa kompren nou. That's unreasoning. Reasoning is the opposite, okay? Number three. Predicament. Predicament. Okay, allow me to say, guys. Le ou we, yon mo komanse pa pre. P-L-E, sa vle di avan. Le ou we, yon mo komanse pa post. P-O-S-T, sa vle di apre. Okay? Predicament. P-R-E-D-I-C-A-M-E-N-T. Predicament. Predicament. P-R-E-D-I-C-A-M-E-N-T. Predicament, it's an embarrassing situation, okay? C'est une situation qui um, qui mal à l'aise, okay? It's a difficult or embarrassment situation. That's what a predicament is, okay? C'est une situation qui embarrassée, all right? Embarrassing. Next, poster. Posture, ok? Posture. Logon mo ki gen te U-L-E, etan koul te gen te C-H la den lo a pronounce lo di ch. Posture. Alright? P-O-S-T-U-R-E. P-O-S-T-U-R-E. Now, tan mwen esplik ko ki sa mo sa vle di, 
allow me to show it to you okay non live moi kon fè nan passé yo moi toujours dit non when you go for a job interview ki so si pose fè you hold your posture gen an pile moun ki marche tan kou dobo si okay why moun nan marche kon sa parce que même les moun nan chita sou chaise ou bien la marche li marche ensemble avec épaule li tomber comme ça you supposed to hold yourself okay hold your posture et sa posture a vle di Okay, John, John Bagay Tetu, the way you hold your shoulder, John Kimbe Kou. That's your posture. All right? Next, probable. Probable. P R O B A B L E. Prop. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm gonna read afterward. Probable. P L O B A B L E. Okay? Something that is probable is something that is likely to happen. Okay? C'est un bagage qui gagne plus chance pour arriver. That's what the word probable means, okay? Something that is likely to happen. Okay? Probably, yes, peut-être, something that is likely to happen. Next word, cutaneous. Okay? Nous même qui travaillons dans nursing home, yo, I'm pretty sure nous n'avons pas de mots ça yo en pile. Cutaneous. 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 All right? C U T A N E O U S C U T A N E O U S Cutaneous is something that's related or affecting your skin. Okay? Yon bagay kap affecte po. Okay? That's cutaneous. Okay? That's your skin, cutaneous. All right? Then we have subcutaneous again. Let nous voyons mot commencer par sub, guys. S-U-B, ça veut dire en bas, under. Okay? Now, another way pour qu'à songer ça, think of submarine. Okay? Tu marin, submarine. Okay? Qui ça submarine? Submarine conduit en bas de l'eau, under. Logon mot qui commence par S-U-B, ça veut dire en bas. So, si m'dou cutaneous, okay, that's your skin. If I say subcutaneous, that means under your skin, okay? En bas pour. S-U-B-C-U-T-A-N-E-O-U-S. Suzette, take out the N. I know. I own. Either what the I've known or be I know. S U B C U T A N E O U S. Okay? Subcutaneous. Okay, under. Si y a bon subcutaneous shot, ça veut dire picu. Ça veut dire côté ou pas pico là, c'est en bas pour under the skin. Okay? Obligated. 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 Obligé. O B L I G A T E D O B L E G A T E D Let me help you guys a little bit with some vocabularies, okay? Là où il y a un mot qui commence par M I D. M I D en veut dire mid. Ça veut dire que Définition moi, ça le pral bola, 
c'est un bagage qui gagne un rapport de nan mi temps mid vle di nan mi temps si on dit mid line OK the middle of the line mid point nan mi temps point OK another one post vle di après if they say post mortem care ça vle di que care after death OK si on dit qu'on ça que pre pre vle di before si on dit prenatal care, si on dit prenatal care, ça veut dire que you care your boy avant que ou accouche. That's what the word pre means before. Si on dit um, what else? Si on dit un, un veut dire not, unpredictable. C'est un bagarre ou pas qu'à predict, ok? Um, this, this veut dire not, disrespectful, dérespecté. OK miss not misunderstand pas comprendre and then you have um no no vledi not no matter what else and then you have um what else what else what else what else what else Gilo toujours. There are more, okay? I can't think of them right now. So uh, my next lesson, we will say pour montrer nous prefix. Get quelques mots là, elle devant mot ou déjà connaît qui ça mot ça pour le parler, okay? And then you have suffix, okay? There are some words or some letter. When you see them at the ending of the words, okay? That will give you an idea of what they are talking about, all right? Now, qui ça me dit nous? Moi dit nous en anglais. Mais ça y est fait. Yo ka pran deux mots, yo kolé yo ensemble. OK? They can take two words and combine them. Combine vle di connecté. Put them together to form another word. All right? And then you have what else? You have um I can't think of them right now. OK? There are more words when I think of them, I'm going to write them down. And then I'm going to have them over. Okay? Listen. For those of you guys, pour nous même qui pas gen mon vocabulaire yo, don't worry. I will post the lesson and the vocabulary up for you guys. Okay? Now, let's do a little bit sentence real quick. Because nous toujours fait phrase ensemble avec vous pour. Alright? Don't let no one persuade you to do anything that you will regret tomorrow. Pas qu'il y a aucun monde force sur fond bagay ou pas regret demain persuade okay to be coerced okay c o e r c e member guy la and then reasoning i'm trying to be reason i'm trying to reason with you be reasonable okay now ça veut dire que m'a essayé pour me raisonner ensemble avant okay moi est raisonné okay i'm in a predicament situation okay I'm in an embarrassment situation. Your situation is difficult. All right? Now, hold your posture, okay? When you are on a job interview. Ça veut dire que mes postures, l'on en interview travail. Okay? Probable. She, she will probably, okay, she will probably be here. All right? Probablement la pla. Okay? Probably mean likely. Okay? Cutaneous. What can I say? What can I say? Okay. Because of my allergy reaction, okay, the doctor had prescribed some ointment for me to apply cutaneous on top of the skin, okay, and also a subcutaneous shot, okay? Moi, je dis que à cause des réactions à l'allergie, le docteur a prescrit moi une crème pour me passer sous le pot et puis un piqué tout en bas pour moi. Et puis, what else? I am obligated to help you guys because I care about each and every single one of you guys. Now, if tonight is the first time you are under my live, I want to take this time to welcome welcome you thank you if this is your second or third time welcome again my name is Mirdalyn Raymond we meet twice a week every Mondays on YouTube every Fridays on Facebook 
if you have not subscribed on my YouTube channel, what I want you to do, go to YouTube, type my name, M-Y-R-D-E-L-I-N-E-R-A-Y-M-O-N-D. That's where you'll be able to subscribe with me. Si c'est première fois où on va live, moi, m'a dit merci et m'a dit bienvenue. Si c'est la deuxième ou troisième fois, ma première si encore. Non, moi, c'est Myodeline Raymond. Nous rencontrons deux fois par semaine. Chaque lundi, sur YouTube. Chaque vendredi, sur Facebook. Ou même qui peut vous abonner ensemble avec moi, ou pral sur YouTube. Ou à moi, qui c'est M-Y-R-D-E-L-I-N-E-R-A-Y-M-O-N-D. C'est là où vous abonner ensemble avec moi. Que mon Dieu m'en bénisse, que Dieu m'en guide, que mon Dieu m'en fait autant sans m'avoir. Ou même qui peut gagner un livre, ou t'as aimé gagner un livre, c'est deux livres pour 65 dollars. Ou qu'a écrit mon bien carré, l'aime dans 6, 17, 4, 19, 53, 81. Ou même qui prépare pour aller prendre examen citizenship ou ou carré l'aime sous même numéro ça. Ou besoin d'aide pour aller prendre examen TTNS, moins qu'a aidé. Ou t'as aimé mon monde faire review en sans m'avoir, ou pour aller prendre boîte CNEA. Moi, ka edeo. Starting next year, I'm going to start doing medical terms with you guys, okay? Call me in that number. And also, ou même ki tare me kase vantou, ou tare me desan, moi ka edeo. Ou même ki gen bagay ki re le stretch mark la. En kreyol yore le mak pitit, but stretch mark pa mak pitit. Mo stretch vle di rale, se le po de tire. Si ou son moun ou trois gros, ou depase yon exe, pour où son temps qu'on élastique et la détire. Et ça vient faire maintenant pour et ça fait yore le stretch mark. Stretch mark, pas bleu, dit mac petit. C'est haïtien qui dit le mac petit, ok? Nous avons une bonne crème qui a aidé. La crème dans 90 jours, ou après on une grosse différence. Elle est efficace et does work, but in order for you to see result, you need to apply it every single day, ok? Thank you guys so much. Ou même qui t'a remis mettre volume dans dada. Ou carré l'aime sous même numéro ça. Envoie le mettre couteau sous. 617 419 53 81. Thank you guys so much. Have a wonderful night. If you have any question or if tonight is your first time, write first time and I will welcome you again. God bless. Je vous aime. Have a wonderful night. I will see you guys Friday right here on Facebook. Bye bye.